So I'm going to make this intro very, very simple while you guys are looking at the recoil pattern that I've created with this particular AMR9 build. I wanted to copy one of my really fast paced builds while also having a very good recoil pattern. So as you guys are seeing right now, the recoil is very manageable. It's a very good medium range choice of SMG. Also at the same time, has a great ADS and mobility by default because of the other attachments we did decide to choose. So call it versatility, call it a do it all kind of weapon. I think I did a very good job at meeting all of those expectations. So for my first attachment, I do have the slate reflector. I am personally not a fan of those iron sights. If you like them, feel free to run it. Or if you have a different optic choice, feel free to run that as well. I do seem to really enjoy the slate reflector on this weapon. Over here to an underbarrel, you're going to want the Sagan Z Axe Grip to control fire aiming stability, gun kick control, recoil control. Self-explanatory, hitting on that versatility by controlling everything we need to in the recoil category at 10% of the gun kick, 7% of the horizontal and vertical recoil control, and of course that much needed fire aiming stability as well. For my underbarrel, I have the SL Skeletal Vertical Grip. Not only are we gaining aim down sight speed and sprint to fire, but also recoil control. So you guys can see here, there's not much to talk about. We're speeding up our handling while also controlling our recoil. When you're touching on a versatility build, this is kind of the perfect attachment for that. For our muzzle, the Quarter Master Suppressor. Basically every video I tend up to end up using this muzzle. What more do I have to say about it? Uh, just the best one in the game. You're going to get large values to recoil control. As you can see there, yes, we're sacrificing ADS and sprint to fire, but at the same time, that's why I chose the SL skeletal vertical grip to make up for what we lost here. In our final attachment here is the AMR Regal Pro Barrel because we're speeding up the weapon further. So we have a great recoil pattern, and now all that was left to do is speed it up even further to make it a very versatile SMG. And you can see it's a large increase to our ADS at 11%. But also we're gaining sprint to fire speed of 4%. And you guys can also see the smaller value stores movement there. And it only a small sacrifice to your recoil control. Let's be honest, we made up for all that we lost there with the quartermaster suppressor. So a little bit of sacrifice doesn't end up being a big deal. It's very easy to hit your shots in the medium ranges. So I made a very similar build to this in previous seasons, but I think with the addition of the quartermaster suppressor, this one hits it right on the head. And I think you guys are really going to enjoy that. So make sure you copy all of these attachments down. And as always, there's the rest of the load out on the screen for you guys make sure you guys are hitting the like and subscribe button for me easiest way to support the channel is by just smashing that like button and we'll tell the youtube algorithm that more people should see this build so make sure again make sure you guys hit the like button for me let's get into the gameplay hope you guys enjoy we are over here on skid row with the amr9 and i'm almost certain there was a variant you know how they do all the special variants for like rust and what was the other ones Russ, Scrapyard. Whatever, you guys get the point. They had all the special variants, and I think there was one called Skid Grow. I believe there was one called Skid Grow for Skid Row, if I'm remembering correctly. Whatever happened to that? Okay, I really want to jump chow this. There it is. I didn't want to get ahead of myself, but at the same time, I knew, obviously, with the advanced UAV that they were there. Where are we going up here? See, we might be able to hit a flank on two of them. Are they both in the window. This guy jumped down. Enemies inside the perimeter. Ammo's running low. Got one down. Hostile UAV in the area. Stop the threat. Stop the I don't know where they're going, bro. Why would? Why are they hunting me down instead of going to the hill? Oh, that's tough. Everything about me is thinking, oh yeah, they're. There's no way they're gonna keep chasing me, right? No way. Apparently, I was wrong. I do have my VTOL. I don't know. If I want to even hit it though. Oh, teammate gave me away.
All right, UAV. Requesting recon flyover. Copy, UAV is on the Tossing subtext. Toss it off. Stand by. Change it back. All right, we're putting a VTOL in. I, uh, I'm disappointed in myself. I am disappointed in myself. Only because I was really close. You're such a loser. I don't know what these, I really don't know what they're doing. Sometimes they play the objectives, other times they just run away. I can't really make sense of it. Can't really make sense of it. That's what you call a choke almost. Guy below me. Here we go. Slip through the pocket here. Tossing subtext. All right, they're on me. I'm gonna go on a flank route here. Uh, they're in the window. Uh, I'm gonna go for them. Look at his laser. That took longer than I wanted, but. I wanted that to pick me up a kill. It didn't. Still on a flank again. Behind off the wall. Bam. Behind us. I don't want to run into this without the right tactic or uh, lethal's tacticals. Yeah, I don't have the correct info here. There we go. I don't know what streak I'm on. 21. Okay. I need that advanced UAV. It's the only way I'm going to feel safe. Apparently, they have a mosquito in the air. That's concerning. I don't even know where they just came from. Thanks for coming. All right. All righty then. Let's do this. Wait for this to drop him. There we go. All right. Behind me. Okay. 
Another advanced UAV. From going to a choke to an MGB, that's that's vibey, because I was pretty close at the beginning. I don't exactly know how close I was. I don't know if I want to give them this Veets hole again here. Screw it. Game's going to end. We'll give it to them. They're all in the middle. All in the warehouse. I guess it's time to MGB here. All righty, ladies and gentlemen, that's what I'm talking about. 84 kills over on Skid Row. I didn't actually think this one was going to end in a nuke. I didn't think you guys were going to see this one.